it's Fairy Phoenix. Welcome to Fairy Phoenix, guys. Thank you so much for stopping by. Be sure to leave your thumbs up, comment, and subscribe to my channel. God bless you. Hi friends. I know that a lot of us, especially in America here, are still very sad about the passing of Kobe Bryant and his precious little daughter yesterday. And um, it's just so, it is quite sobering when we realize that life, the life that is in us can be taken away in a, in a second. It, the breath that is within our body does not belong to us. It belongs to God and that hits home for most of us when a relative dies, a friend or someone like Kobe, who a lot of people think celebrities, they think celebrities are inv invincible, like they'll just be here forever. But unfortunately, death, it comes for all of us at some point. And um, the key for us is that we live a life that is pleasing to God. So my video today, guys, after all of what happened yesterday and all that other people are dealing with, because Kobe Bryant lost his life and they're, they're public figures, but there's so many other people who are dealing with these, the, these kind of issues at this time, losing loved ones, being sick, so many people who are sad right now. So I hope that this video that we're about to watch will help to cheer us up at least a little bit. This little child who is praying and praying so sincerely. Let's go ahead and watch and see how it makes us feel. Fire God. Fire God. We thank you. We thank you. For this food. For this food. With any blessing. We ask you to bless it. Make it nourishment to your body, to our body. Bring it all the poor boys and girls. Bless all the boys and girls. All over the world. All over the world. To receive food. To receive food. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Isn't that so cute? That a little child can pray so sincerely now a lot of people are looking at the death of kobe bryant because as i said before people die all the time people die all the time but we never really feel it so deeply until it's somebody who is close to us or it is somebody that we look at like a kobe bryant who we thought so a lot of people think these people are invincible no life the breath that is in our body is borrowed it belongs to God and no matter how powerful a lot of people are thinking that they are it belongs to God and at any time he can take it from us so with this life that you have in your body right now that we have do good things with it bless other people with it be a blessing be a light to others because at any given time it can be taken away and the one thing that is sure in this life is death so we can live very long very very long some people live too long but life can be very short so with the breath that you have in your body right now be the best you that you can be give of yourself to others love and spread light to the world so that when you're gone at least you'll be remembered at least remembered like Kobe or maybe it might not be in such a huge scale, but at least somebody can say Natalie was a good person. Until next time, guys. Peace. Hi, guys. I want to introduce you to my book, How a Player Got Played. It is now available on Amazon. You can get yours in soft copy for only three bucks. How a Player Got Played.